Amarillo College's Engineering Club held a mousetrap car competition on Wednesday, October 27th. The cars were judged on how far they traveled and the winners won cold hard cash. Two competitors had different ideas about why their car was successful. The back wheels were, were bigger and it made it go farther. I believe it was very successful because it worked out to the schematics we drew for it. Hernandez says he was inspired to major in engineering because of his father. He was really tinkering with tools a lot and he always talked about bridges and buildings and what effort is put into making them and that fascinated me from the start. ACE holds monthly contests to keep students actively learning while enjoying themselves as well. I think it was the uh, fun of it. Other people just getting here together, pure fun, pure sport. Um, everybody wants to see who can do better. I think it just gives them more of a sense of being part of a community versus just isolated. If you ever have the chance to build your own mousetrap car, ACE students and staff have plenty of pointers. Your string has to be long enough if you've got larger wheels so that it slowly comes out and allows you know you to go further. Use fishing line. If you can get big wheels in a small frame, you'll probably go further than most. Though Hernandez was beat by a nine-year-old boy, he feels optimistic about the future of the next generation. Deep down, I feel a little a little kid crying in me. Um, but I feel I feel great that I was beat by a nine-year-old because, you know, if he's the future, then it's, the future is pretty bright. The engineering's next competition will be held in November. It will be a logic puzzle, and flyers will be handed out with more details. For the Ranger Online, this is Abby Brown.